Alright guys, so I'm making a real quick video showing the two things you can use to uh, make your Destiny videos or whatever gaming videos you want to make. Uh, the first one is a share factory. I used to use this a lot because my old laptop could not handle Sony Vegas whatsoever. So I stuck using this on a PlayStation 4. This is a really good program on your console to make your videos. What you gotta do is go to a uh, new project, and here's all the stuff you have. For me, it's gonna be Destiny, so I'm gonna hit Destiny. It's your intro, your outro, and whatever. So. I'm going to leave the intro in and hit square to start project. So this is your intro right here. We got to do is hit X, add clip, and try to find a good clip. All right. Find a good clip you're looking for and hit square. Here's me on uh, just dancing. So anyways, you hit square where you see the toy at. You got your time bender, which is slows down time, fast up your uh, video or slow it down. Split clip, trim, move clip, delete clip, clone clip, and music volume. The most important thing to do is get your volume and max it out 200. For some reason, once you render through this program, it just decreases the volume by a lot. So hit square to select to all and X to confirm it. You split clip. You just go through. What do you want? What do you want to keep? You can just basically just watch the thing and once you see one split, hit X, confirm, and keep going through. And hit X. Next, hit square to delete the clip. It'll automatically uh, drop in right next to it. Next is add in music. Here, hit X and go to add music. These are all music that they give you. Which one I use? No. Right there. So you can start it right here since I didn't start all the way down there. So I had to fix that. And go to edit music. What do you want is move music. You can just Move over with your analog stick. Let's say I want it kind of in the beginning. I think that's good. Hit X. Now, the intro, then music. Alright, so that's where I want it. Suck it right there. If the music's a little too loud for you, you can also drop the audio down. Go back, edit music, edit music volume, and drop it down quite a bit. If it's too loud, like if you got commentary going on and stuff. All right, this is my second program that I use to edit my videos. The first. Well, share factory through the PS4. If you don't have a computer or don't want to be able to get this program, I suggest use that. The reason why I'm using the share factory because my old laptop could not handle this program. I was having so much problems. So here I got like a $1,100 laptop specifically for Vegas Movie Studio 14. That's the only reason why I got it because I need powerful laptop. 
hands because the preview window is lagging and it has all sorts of problems. Anyways, when you first start it up, you have this, it looks just like this. You have new, showing how tutorials. Start using what you want to go to new. We can go with this, but if you don't have everything set up for uh, PS4 Share Factory, the share, the capture sun, it's always 720p. It's no higher or lower, so 1080 or anything. It's always 720. So 720 you want because you want to match the media settings. So here you got your um, preview window. Master volume, this is for volume for all audio, your whole project. Text, video, audio, and music. Here you got project menu, all your projects are going to be in here. Explore, transitions, video effects, media generators. This is for like all your text stuff. To find your video, first, you want to download all your video gameplay from your PS4 onto memory stick and take your memory stick and take your computer and pop it in. And for me, it's uh, USB drive D I'm looking for. You see PS4, share, video clips, Destiny, Destiny 2 Beta, and Share Factory. Well, I want is Destiny. Should have all your videos in here. When you click your video, take it in, drop it in. If it's a new video, they never been in this program, the audio will load. The reason why mine did not do that because I already did this video, I already worked on it previously. That's the reason why it's not loading. So here's your uh, video right here. Like I said, you won't have everything match your program, your uh, video. If you're 720, you want this to be 720. You want your when you render, you want to be 720. So, first, this is already matches going on. So, what you want to do is cut that out. You do not want it in. So, I'm looking for when I go in orbit. I mean, when I find a match. Here, I found my match. You can use your um, wheel on your mouse, zoom in closer, and use your arrows right or left to uh, move the video around frame by frame like I am right now. This right here is black, so hit S for split and delete it. I'll go back to beginning. So I'm looking for when I get into a game. I want and also if you're talking to your friends, you'll make sure you want to edit it properly. You don't want to like cut stuff out. Like I think right here I'm talking or somebody. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut that out. And look. I'm cutting that out. Like right here, I'm missing my shot self. If you wanna cut that, you can. All you gotta do is hit S, split it. But I'm gonna keep it in right here. It's when I die, so. I died, I'm gonna hit S. And once I respawn in, I'm gonna scan through, find a good sweet spot to start. Like right here, it looks like it. Cause I melee somebody. Cause that's when the action started. So I'm gonna go back a bit and cut it, delete it and drag it over. That's what you gotta do your whole videos. You gotta make it look good and stuff. One thing Share Factory cannot do is color correction. Cause we were when you recording these videos, they will get ugly like 
they won't look that great. So what you do is go on FX, track FX, this is for your whole track. You can do it in digital videos right here as well, but I'm going to do a whole track. Go to color corrector, add it, and color curves. Okay. I mean, add and okay. So this is your color corrector. It corrects all the color because it looks faded and washed out. So I already got a preset saved for Destiny. It's right here. You can see major difference already. I can turn it up to saturation if I want more saturation in it. I can like turn it down, make it black and white. Here's a custom one. This is for your light colors, for your like really bright colors like white. This is your mid colors, whatever is the mid, and this is your dark colors like black, like very dark stuff. And the second one is a color curves. You can use how it is right now, like that. But I got pre-salary. So I can go back here and do a little fine tuning. If I don't like how it turned out. You can see it's just heck of a lot better now. You can see major difference. Well guys, this is this video. Hope you guys enjoyed me showing you how I can make my videos. Uh, one thing I f did forget is your project. Once you're done, you can go right to make movie and hit upload to YouTube. Or you can just render it. The render will save on a computer, then you can upload on YouTube. Either or. Guys, this is this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Me showing you how I edit my videos. Hope, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Peace out.